Hey plant gang, uh, this is not my favorite plant that I'm standing in front of, but it is one that you're gonna run into quite a bit in the landscape industry. Not always this green one, there's variegated cultivars, ones that are bright gold. Uh, very interesting plant, Euonymus kyachovicus. We want to, I want to know the specific cultivar in this case, Manhattan, Manhattan Euonymus. Again, Euonymus Kyachovicus. The cultivar is Manhattan. Why have I chosen that? Well, it is really the industry standard. It's the one that you're going to see quite a bit in the nursery industry. Opposite leaf arrangement, shiny, glossy foliage that stays evergreen for us throughout the winter time. Uh, this plant has been recently cut back down to the ground and you can see it is uh, coming back. Uh, probably one year ago it was cut back down to the ground and now it's coming back completely. Uh, to me this plant is most spectacular uh, in its new spring foliage. Beautiful, beautiful green spring foliage. Uh, but then it tends to uh, get darker with a little bit of age, still glossy. Uh, this does have a variety of kind of insects, scales uh, that do bother this plant. Uh, but it's very durable. That's why you see it in the home landscape a lot. Um, maybe it's good for a person who could care less about plants uh, to have in their landscape because it doesn't take much care. Uh, one you should know, uh, also susceptible to powdery mildew, uh, which you need to watch out for. And in fact, I can see some powdery mildew on this one right here. Euonymus kyachovicus, uh, the, Man the Manhattan Euonymus. Manhattan Euonymus, hardy from zones five to eight. This plant can get four to six foot high, can spread out three to five foot wide. It is a broad-leaved evergreen. It can be used for hedges. Uh, does have flowers that are not uh, super uh, showy, but can be nice. Uh, they do uh, have a little bit of a fragrance to them. Uh, but uh, overall, a plant that you want to use sparingly, but can be used quite a bit in a harsh situation. And here's a landscape tip. Good for foundations, hedges, screens, groups or masses, the cultivar Manhattan is reportedly more resistant to euonymus scale.